Alrighty, welcome back to Finding Paradise, where last time this game took... Did I say Finding Paradise again? I swear to God, that's 3 for 3. <laughs> I'm, or 0 for 3, I'm just bad. Imposter Factory, Imposter Factory, my goodness. I'm just not going to get it. But anywho, uh, after exploring the big old house, like, three murders happened. And poor Quincy just can't catch a break. It's unlocked. And so this time, we're probably going to try and figure out what the heck is going on. And maybe eventually we'll hang out with Eva and Neil. Maybe not. We'll see. Oh my god, it's real! Why is that cat so long? Excuse me? Wait, no. That's not what I came here to ask. You know what? I'm just gonna straight up say it. There are two of you. That's right, I saw it. You were at two places at once. Also, I think that sink downstairs freaking resets time. I don't want to say Groundhog Day, but there's something bonkers going on. You're aware of how crazy you sound, right? Oh, trust me, I know. I mean, am I crazy? Maybe. But is this crazy? Definitely. I don't know what you expect me to say. Just answer me this. Do you have any clue what I'm talking about? Not at all. Aha! You're lying. Why do you think that? Well, let's see. There are dead bodies downstairs, you're alone, and a stranger approaches with crazy tales. If you aren't in on all of this, then why are you not running? And where would I run to? I don't know, somewhere away from me? Look, to be honest, you are freaking me out. But it's more in a strange way, then. Well, I don't know. But I just don't think you're the killer or anything. How do you know that? You don't know me. And given the circumstances, even I would think I could be the killer. I'm not sure. It's just a feeling. There's just something about you. I just feel like you can't be the killer. Okay, I know that's supposed to be good, but why does it feel a bit emasculating? Well, why aren't you running? From what? From me. Why, uh, why would I be running from you? I mean, a mysterious stranger appearing double in a time-resetting murder loop. If what you're saying is true, then it sounds like I would be the suspicious one. Uh, can't argue with you there. But I guess, I feel like there's something about you too? I mean, this is so crazy that I feel like I'm still in denial, but... There's something about you that makes me feel like you can't be the killer either. Take me to it. What? The sink downstairs. You said it resets time? You believe me? No, don't be ridiculous. But given the circumstances, I'd like to see what's making you act this way. Alright, I guess that's the best I could hope for. Come on, I'll show you. That door's locked now. Kitty cat, what's going on, bro? You know this cat? We met five minutes ago, if that counts. Yeah? Think he's the culprit? Well, there's a red herring on the carpet over there, so probably not. Har har. Oh wait, there actually is. So the cat is the killer? My whole life is a lie. Now how are we gonna get, uh... Idri out of there. Oh yeah, there is one problem. Or Idina. Stay away! Let me try. Hey, are you alright in there? Go away! I'm not letting anyone in until my bodyguards get here! That's fine, I'm leaving. Could you just knock on the door every five minutes or so though? What? Why? Just so we know you're alive, of course. 
I mean, you're all alone in there. If something happens, no one would know. And who knows if there are other entrances? Those singled out are easy targets after all. In fact, this murder podcast I was just listening to the other day said... There. Why do you listen to murder podcasts? It's complicated. I mean, true crime podcasts can be pretty entertaining. Like Wine and Crime. That's the one that I listen to. That Liquid's fiancé recommended to all of the boys, and we got hooked in on it. Is this the sink you were talking about? Yeah. Alright, go ahead. Are you going to do it? I'm gonna do it. And now it's when it's not gonna work. Uh, actually, wait. What? You can't wash your hands with someone watching? No, it's just... Do you mind if we do it together? Why? I mean, maybe that way. There's more of a chance we'd both travel in time? I don't really know how sync-related time travel works, but... I'm just tired of being the only crazy person every time I come out of this bathroom. This better not be some convoluted scheme to try something weird with me. Don't flatter yourself. There are corpses outside, and I'm not in the mood. Dude, imagine. <laughs> well, come on. Wait! What? Just in case this doesn't work. Can you tell me a secret so it's easier to convince you that we've met before? You're sounding more and more sketchy by the minute. I know. Lavender. Huh? Just lavender. Okay. Wait! What? You said you met me in these other supposed timelines? Yeah. I thought you didn't believe this. I don't, but... Never mind. Look, I'm just curious. What did I say to you? Well, we didn't really talk much, but... Oh, you did say there was something that you wanted to ask and show me? That was the first time I saw you, I think. Hmm. Any idea? Not a clue. Okay, let's get this over with. Right. They were just wasting water at this point. Wait! What?! Never mind. I forgot I was gonna s what I was gonna say. Okay, let's do this. Close your eyes, fool. Is something supposed to happen? I don't know. I guess maybe it already happened? For the last few times, I just turned on the water and washed my hand like this. And closed my eyes like this. And then I opened my eyes and walked outside. L Lenry? Uh, hey! So is it really just us that can do this time travel shenanigan? It's been reset again. I guess I am the only- I, I'm the only one who can use a sink after all. At least it's easier to talk to Linry now. They should still be at the party room. Or not? Hello? That light, it's so bright. Where is it coming from? Was there a light fixture on there? No rice robot, but everything else still looks relatively the same. What about the kitchen? Them too?
So either we went really, really forward or really, really back. Door's locked. This one should be open. Locked. Whatever. And in this room... Oh my! Oh my goodness! What? What is happening? I don't understand. What is this? Someone's really got an active imagination going here. Oh my. Oh my. Is this feeling? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, we zooming. Why am I zooming? We zoom, zooming. What? Oh, my goodness. The door won't open. Was that the door? Wait, but now I'm slow again. If I go back down, can I zoom zoom again? No. I'm confused. Should we just finally drink the whiskey? Is this all because I didn't drink? Oh. Okay, it didn't get any better. It's in fact getting worse. This poor man and this poor woman, they're just getting... Oh no... Oh no... Why are there so many of them? Well, I'm glad one room is normal. Whoa! What is happening to me? What is happening to me? Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. What in the... Um... Even just one of you was enough trouble as it was. Whoa! Oh, oh, what the pug?! Hey, wait! Hey! Linry? What is- what is going on? I'm sorry. This was going to be about you, but then this happened. I ran more iterations, but I can't stop it. It keeps on happening, and it shouldn't. Wait, you can't just leave like that? Please, just tell me what's going on. That's actually what I've been trying to figure out myself. Seems like you weren't reset like the rest, though. Guess that's one more thing to fix. Reset? But this is good. Maybe you can show me what you saw. What I saw? Well, it all started when I went to the washroom earlier, and then... Hmm, you've seen some weird stuff. This might come in handy. What the pug was that? Funny coincidence, though. That really did make the sink seem like a time machine. 
but the chances that my resets lined up so perfectly with the sink. Improbable. Are you even talking to me? Wait a minute, am I a robot? Sorry, as I said, I'm just a bit preoccupied right now. But basically, I created this world, and I created you. What? What? This wasn't something I wanted to show you this iteration, but... Since I need to keep you around for reference, you might as well go out and have a look. Hold on, just back up a minute. What do you mean, you created... I mean, what even is this place? I think you'll find the answers inside here. Sorry you have to keep these weird memories. Sorry you have to keep these weird memories, though. I'll need them later for reference. But just try not to worry about it. Not worry about it? Yeah, don't worry about it. Come on, I'll meet you in there. But... But, 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 get your butt in there. <laughs> she kicked him in there. What a mess. Might as well let this run one run its course. I guess the first time's never the charm, but to happen every time? Every time, when... Wait a minute. Oh, what the hey? Got kicked downstairs. Hey! You said you'd meet me in here! This tonal shift is very interesting. Oh, look how they're doing the stairs and everything. Oh, this is so cool. Act two. Where am I? It feels odd to just leave everything behind like this. But why did she send me here? Data. This game is really good, and it's really interesting so far for being a complete uh, change in tonal shift and everything like that, but honestly, I am all in for it. It is so cool. So, so cool. Um, with that, though, I think I'm going to call this one just a little bit short because it feels like a good place to stop. Um, so, with that, thank you all so much for watching this episode of Imposter Factory. Yes, I got the name right, and maybe I'll get it right in the next episode, too. So, I will catch you then for wherever we are now. Bye.